What's up everybody and welcome back to the Pack to Glory where we are joining our team where we last left it at the end of last episode, approximately two minutes ago for myself. But unfortunately, the man sitting just behind me, just over there, I think just out of shot, Kazooie ended our lives with a Portuguese skeleton. Why I let him do the Eusebio once he could get all in five star skills, I'm not really sure. That's pretty, should, I should have give that to Toby or something like that. But today we are coming up against Toby. Once we have played against the computer and hopefully unlocked ourselves some packs, we're going to be challenging to buy us game and to unlock none other than Steven Gerrard, one of the most anticipated new icons in this game. He looks absolutely crazy. Toby is going to be gatekeeping him. So hopefully in between playing against Toby, we can win a game with this team, upgrade our La Liga team with the packs, and then smash Toby and get Gerard in instead of Romeo because he's absolutely doing my nothing. If you are enjoying this series, please do drop a like. I'm enjoying making it. We are smashing it all out in one day, essentially. So it's an interesting one. It's an interesting way to do a Road to Glory, but it's content for you guys before the game actually comes out in a Road to Glory kind of format. So I hope you are going to enjoy it over on this channel. For now, though, it is as simple as going into the single player seasons. We're going to, like I said in the last episode, I restarted the season. You play against the same teams again, which is kind of annoying. So we're playing against the second team that we played, but last time we played it on professional, and this time we're playing it on world class. So it's going to be an interesting one. We've got a better team. We actually won the other game in the last episode by more than we beat it when it was on professional, which is really weird because I actually had chemistry on my players. But enough jibber jabber. Without further ado, what we're all here for is the packs and the game against the YouTuber. So in the meantime, let's get into single player seasons and let's hopefully get that W and get them packs. Actually, before we do that, we got, we got some other packs that we got some other players that need to go into this team, didn't we? And we need to fix that. We need to bring in Thomas Lamar at left wing. He's coming in there. We need to bring back Hernandez, I suppose, at left back. We got Hernandez or Gaia. Gaia's got the pace. Hernandez has got the defending and the physical. I'm going to go for Hernandez. And then we need a La Liga centre mid. Bruno's so slow. Have we got a CDM? No. Have we got a Cam? Vazquez. Okay, so that's, that's not the best. So what we're aiming for in this episode is we're going to use the other squad. We're going to get Vazquez, Hernandez and Lamar onto the bench, even though they're full fitness anyway. It doesn't really matter too much. And then we are going to hopefully pack ourselves a Modric or something like that to slot into this team and smash Toby with. That's the plan. Let's see if we can actually do it. I don't know what that arrow is. But we've banged it in with Firmino in the third minute. So I'm, I'm very happy. Let's have a look at the trainer because I don't know why that's come on. Have I put, messed about with the buttons? Yep, apparently I've turned on shot, shot elevation instead of the time finishing is the case. But whatever, that's fine. We've banged it. I'll take it. Nice little turn by Sahar into Firmino. Turns onto a strong foot and finesses it past the goalie very, very nicely. Oh, Zahar has spun the offside trap. That is cheeky. That is just far too cheeky. Oh, that was naughty, because he's inspired me. We're doing silky little goals now. Come on, Bobby. I don't know what this defence is doing. Jesus, that was a terrible time shot. Oh, okay, I just keep getting away with it. And the terrible ones are getting blocked. Oh, what a header. Big Gary Cahill? Is that who that was? Yes, it was. Captain Cahill with a bullet header. Half time, 3-0. The AI is playing better and it's actually making chances than the first time we played it. On, now it's on world class, but we're still absolutely battering it. I don't know, maybe, maybe we need to restart the season again. I tried again. I did try some squad battles on world class before I started this series. And yeah, it's crazy how much different it is on seasons. It's, it's mad. I don't know if it's something about squad battles because there's rewards to be earned, but it just it try, it seems to try so much harder. I don't even know what it's doing, but I'm just, I'm just gonna accept the packs. I'm sure you guys are, and you wanna see the packs and the games against the YouTubers. So it probably doesn't matter too much. I'm just, I'm just gassed to be making it. Thank you very much to the Game Changer program for letting me make these videos is, I, I'm just buzzing, it's so sick. Oh, that is filthy, 
filthy from Jan Moutinho. What a finish for 4 0. We're just banging goals. We're actually just banging goals now. This is crazy. Oh, Frank, stop it. This is just silly. He's shooting so good. Right, there we go. The computer has been handed an absolutely fat L. 5 nil. will hopefully get us lots and lots of useful consumables. Maybe some chem styles as we start moving in with the end goal of playing against Mike to test this team. We, we want to be whacking hawks and hunters and all of that sort of stuff on our players. So we've got five 7.5k packs and two of the 125k. So we're going we're gonna to spice it up from the last episode and we're going to go for the 125k, then we'll do all of the 7.5s and, and then we'll finish it off with a 125k again. Okay, this is Brazilian left wing. Oh my God, are you kidding me? Oh, it was nearly Neymar, but it's Coutinho. I suppose he's better than Lamar. We can stick him in. He's doing a little salsa for us. I wish it was Neymar doing the salsa. That is, oh, that is, that is frustrating. That's what that is, very frustrating. I can't complain about getting an 88, but I thought for a second we just pulled one of the best players on the game. We've got Party. He's definitely going into my team. Valencia can definitely come into the Premier League team. We've got some decent little players there, actually, to be honest with you. Anarchy Williams looks naughty at striker. Very, very... I don't think any of the others are going to be getting in, and we've got quite a few duplicates of decent-ish players, but that was actually pretty good. I can't complain about that at all. Right, five, seven and a half K back then, after pulling our Coutinho, and we will get in the first one, a non-rare, which is good, because we might be using our rares for a squad fitness, what are we saying? Yes, we are, and we've got a marksman as well, maybe for Frank, that would be absolutely sick. A thousand coins is absolutely useless to me because I've got about 1.8 million and then 10 million FIFA points. But we're doing a Road to Glory style, so that was pack number one. Number two, hit us with another non-rare and another fitness card, and I'll be absolutely buzzing. Oh, no, it's a board, okay. Portugal, right mid. Why? Every time, really? Every, that's like the, every single time we open packs, we get correct, I don't want him. I just need to play. We got a squad fitness though, okay. Number three then. I, was, I think that's maybe the, f I haven't opened many 7.5k packs, only on my other account to try and get some squad fitnesses for that. But that's the first time I've seen a board in one. This time we've got Suseta, okay. Not the best, he ain't going anywhere near any of my teams. No squad fitness, but a sniper. That could be decent to put on Frank as well, to be honest with you. Maybe on Gerard if we manage to win him off Toby. So that was number three. Number four. What are we saying? Striker, Watford, grey. Another very, very sweaty. Sweaty, starter, player. So then finally, the last seven and a half K pack, looking for consumables. We are going to get ourselves a little bit of... Bastos, okay. <laughs> he ain't going anywhere near any of the team's consumables. What are we saying? Left mid to left wing is decent for some chemistry. An injury card just in case, a nice little West Brom kit. We'll confirm all of that and we'll go to the big boy. What did we say we need? We want a huge La Liga striker. So we've got Coutinho to go in. Now we want a massive striker. Come on, hit me with a Suarez or a Griezmann or someone like that. Come on, make it a big one. It is a board, that is good, that's a good start. It is Spanish, it's a centre mid. Bayern Munich, it's Thiago, okay. He's gone down, he's 86, not too shabby. What else have we got chilling in this pack? Boateng and Sergio Roberto as well. Radecki, Pizzi, Dembele can be coming into the squad. Ben Yedder could maybe come into the squad. Lots and lots of new players, I will take it. So there we go, let's go and see what changes we can make to our squads with them. So, if I remember correctly, we got ourselves a Antonio Valencia to come in at right back. Yes, we did. Is there any other Premier League players that we could maybe be changing up? Let's see. <laughs> We've always got David Silva. We've got Jamie Vardy, but I just love Zaha so much. Lingard and David Silva. Like I said, it's so sad not using them. Maybe 
Should we drop Frank Lampard back to centre mid and put David Silva camp? Let's, gi let's give it a whirl. Let's give it a try. I feel like Milner will do a better job than Romeo as well, so we're going to leave him there. I'll we'll have Lampard at camp. And Lampard at centre mid and David Silva camp. Okay, and then if we go into the squad selector and jump over to our La Liga team, we can drop Zhao Quinn, of course, for the Dembele that we just packed, which is very, very nice. There he goes into the squad. Five star week for four star skills, very, very nice. We can drop Lamar, unfortunately. I don't even think he got to play for Coutinho, which is beautiful as well. We can drop Muriel for Anarchy Williams, who smashes him in every stat. Very, very good. We can drop out Vazquez. We didn't get any centre mids, but we did get a CDM, which was, of course, party. Hmm. Okay, in he goes. Got the Lampard at camp. Have we got any other La Liga players that should be going into our squad? I'm going to keep the pace instead of going for Sergio Roberto. I think that's about it. Not too shabby at all to be taking this team into a game against Toby. So then, all that is left to do is a fitness card on Lampard because the man plays every game. A fitness card on Cannavaro because the man plays it. Maybe, maybe actually, we should have a little look at some consumables for the boys, some chemistry styles. What do we want to stick on, Frank? We've got six of them. We've got a Hunter, that I feel like that'd be wasted. We could maybe go Marksman for dribble and shooting and physical. We could go Hawk, passing and physical, it's not the best. I'm thinking Sniper for dribbling and shooting, or Marksman for dribbling and shooting and physical. Mm, I don't know which is better. Let me know which one you would put on down in the comment section. I actually can't decide. Between these three, Marksman, Sniper and Architect, I cannot decide. As I've dropped him deep, I think I'm going to go for Architect. I know he's not deep in this squad, but in the other one he is. So I'm going to go for Architect for the passing and the physical. Okay. Yeah, Architect. Let's do it. Let's get into the game against Toby and try and unlock Gerard to pair up Lampard and Gerard in midfield. Right, here we go. Whoa, my God, look at the Gerard squad. It's, it's, it's not even that Liverpool theme. It's just a ridiculous, a ridiculous Premier League team. Like, that team would win the Premier League. Unlike, okay, I'm not, I'm not going to make that joke. That's mean. That's, that's, that's salty. I want Gerard for my squad. That team is ridiculous. We are going to need to pull out something big to be Toby here. Come on. We've won two icons out of three. Can we make it three out of four? Toby has played a lot of this game. So we're gonna to need to be on our, bring our A game. His squad is mad. But mine is not too shabby either. Oh, nice ball, Frank. Dembele, that's Kante chasing him. We should be away. We are away. Come on, okay. Frank with the drilled shot. Maybe if at the time that he'd have gone in. Aguero. Cannavaro's tracking him though. Cannavaro is a beast on this game. Oh, he's too much of a heavy touch there though. He's kept the counter attack alive. Oh, Lenglet, what are you doing, son? Ooh. Did you time it? Did you time it? Should have timed it. There we go. He's beating Allison in the air. Toby's face, if you could see it through the gap there. <laughs> Big Anarchy Williams on his debut. That is what I'm talking about. The ret we've been returned with the exact same thing. <laughs> God damn it. <gasps> that would have been so cheeky. May Lukaku wins everything. We can't be. Okay. Okay. There's half time. I, don't, I think we deserve to be ahead, the amount of chances we've had. But I did only score from a corner, and Toby did the exact same thing back to me. So 
1 1, I'll take it. If we can nick a goal, if one of them mad saves from Allison, if we can squeeze one of them past them, we'll be doing alright and we'll be getting Gerard into our squad. Oh, you've just brought on more subs. Do you know what? I'm doing it myself. If he's bringing on subs, I'm bringing on subs. Who have we got on the bench that can come on and make a difference? Wilfried Zaha. And we're going to bring on David Silva and drop Lampard back. That's about it, isn't it? I didn't really plan this. Okay. Maybe move Zaha to striker and put Williams on the wing. Let's do it. Oh, he's brought on Eden Hazard. We know how dangerous Hazard can be and De Bruyne as well. <laughs> Come on, for the road to glory. For the Gerrard. Come on, David. Yes, you've got your toe on it. What is that first touch from Wilfried Zaha? The substitute coming in big with the new first touch spin. McGeady spins back and perfect time shots it into the far corner. What a goal. Come on, Frank, I need you doing better there, bro. Oh, Lampard, what are you doing? Oh, I couldn't get, I couldn't change to him quick enough. My changing with the right stick just wasn't on point then. And he's got a nice little chance to finish with Stevie G. He's never missing that, and that is a terrible pass from me. Come on, Andy. Get your head back into the game. He's brought on some mad subs. We need to be at our best here to win. The subs are killing me. The subs are killing me. No! Have you gone 4 2 4? Nah, same formation. They're just all over me. Oh, fair play. That was a great finish from Kevin De Bruyne. How? How has he got his feet to that? Frank, please. <gasps> no, I was literally on the edge of the box. Toby's dancing. I am gutted. We haven't got Gerard. The calorie of the substitutions, I just couldn't keep up. And he came back in like the last 10 minutes with two good goals to be fair play. To be fair to him, fair play. We are two out of four. We got a 50% success rate of unlocking the icons. My team is looking very good and it feels very good. We just dropped off a little bit. Midfield with that okay guy. He's literally okay, he's called okay. And party dropped off and Lenglet at the back. We're getting there, we're getting there. It was a very close game. I feel like we could have scored a lot more in the first half if our time of finishing a little bit better. There's a couple of other chances, but fair play to Toby. He played very well. He was very solid and scored a couple of very nice goals. So that means, unfortunately, that no Steven Gerrard will be going into our squad. He looks so good. Toby said he dropped him back to centre mid because he was kind of breaking up the play at camp. It's probably to do with that 69 balance and 71 agility, but he was doing bits and ruining me when he dropped him back to centre midfield. Unfortunately for us, he won't be going into our team. But that is where we're going to leave this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, please do drop a like. Remember to subscribe if you are new around here. Thanks once again to the Game Changers program. And I'll see you guys very soon.